Witam wszystkich bardzo serdecznie. Jestem Beś, to jest kolejny odcinek z gry The Walking Dead. Don't ask me how I'm doing. Let's just keep going. Dobra. Lee, you okay? Yeah. Let's keep at it. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. Boże, jakie tutaj teksty lecą. Judging by the decor of this room, I guess they were PBS watchers. Hey, my parents' house looked a lot like this. And they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. Nie ma tu raczej nic. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. What do you call this thing? Art? Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go ahead. Taki mam zamiar w sumie. Fucking mouth. Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? Kenny and I can handle this. Dude, let me help you. You're already hurt. Even more reason we all don't need to risk it. You worry about her. And if all this goes bad, you might be Clementine's last hope. Will. Keep an eye out. Ow! Oh. I'm okay! I'm okay! Just get me out of here! Shh! Quiet, Ben! Or they'll be on top of us! Yeah, try to keep your mouth shut. I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. We're gonna get your ass up. Really? I thought you. Chyba go na wylot przybiło co? Fucking hell. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. Cut. We can get you up. We can. Ow! Oh God! Fuck. He's screwed. He's not screwed. He can't die down here. What do you want to do, Ken? We can't. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, God, don't let them get to me. Do you have any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back. She needs you, Lee. Kenny! This is not a discussion! Hell no, man! I'm not leaving! What did I just say? Let's get bit and get out of here! What the fuck, Kenny? Lee, Lee, it's okay. No, 
kid. No, it's not! It's just something I gotta do. You know that. Go get that girl. Back, you sons of bitches! Damn it, yeah. Jenny! God damn it! What happened? I, I tried to help. What the fuck happened? Was just too many of them. Ben was really messed up, and I don't know. It's nothing else. God damn! God! I heard a shot. Kenny made sure that Ben didn't feel any more pain than he had to. What? It was Ben's biggest fear, you know. Kenny had one bullet and that's how he used it. God, poor fucking kid. Może gdybym wtedy Bena puścił, to Kenny by teraz szedł z nami. Kurwa mać. You saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry, Lee. Maybe he did get away. I don't know. We should go. No. Right behind you. Do you want to talk? Kenny was my friend. He could be tough to like, but I agreed with him most of the time. So, we were assholes together, I guess. Look, Lee, this is a shitty time, but I want to clear something up. What is it? Now with Kenny gone, it means Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. Yeah, you do. Let me take all the risks. That's not what I mean, necessarily. It's what I mean. It's what we gotta do. Fuck! Be careful across here. River Street's just up ahead. Whoa, careful. Even the buildings are full. They never know where their next meal is. No, they don't. I... I didn't mean... It's fine. Let's go.
Going first. You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg, and you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hot. Decision doesn't make itself. I'll go first, in case anything happens out there. You sure? Yeah. Just go nice and slow. Bosh. Teraz tylko brakuje, żeby zemdlał jeszcze. Almost there. It's an easy crossing. Good. Going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Let's meet outside of town, by the train. Are you nuts? It's the only way. Do you hear me? Yeah, by the train. Jesus, we'll be there. Czyli już troszeczkę kolory zmienia, widzę. Masakra. Jest to same. Skąd wy gdzieś? Na wyczucie? O ja wchodzę. I 
they got us adjoining rooms. Where is she? I already told you, she's fine. You look horrible. Go over there. Put your things down. Let me out! Who's out there? Shh. Quiet, please, sweetie. Your things. There. This is all I've got, okay? You travel light. I don't believe you. Okay, fine. That's what I thought. You shouldn't lie. Sit down. Do you know who I am? No. I don't know anything about you. You wouldn't. People like you don't. Now you're thinking, who would have it out for me, huh? A few weeks back, there might have been a station wagon in the forest, mm -hmm. full of all sorts of food. Things you need to survive. Yeah, I'm not some cannibal, V. Some killer out in the woods. Some villain. I'm just a dad. I coach Little League. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. Do for the you... taking? Do you know what you took from me? you start on who took what from who I didn't take her from you I rescued her from you don't you get that <sighs> have you ever hurt somebody you care about yes of course who my wife Clementine said she wasn't with you. I heard her a long time ago. How? In a lot of ways. She traveled for work. I didn't like that. I wanted a family. A reasonable thing to want? So we fought, and it made my biggest fear come true. Got sick one day on my way to class. Canceled it and went home. Found her there with someone else. Killed him. I was mad at her for so long, and I can't imagine how much pain she felt. How about you? I hurt her. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, you are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. I'm sorry. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them. 
a day later, in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? We all do. Some more than others. I'm not like you. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. I did what I had to. You abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. She deserved it. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. I fucked up. Yes, you did. How could you know all this? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lead, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I'll leave her home. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. That's not happening. You're crazy. Keeping her with you is crazy. I'm bitten. What? I got bit, and I'm gonna make sure you end up the same way as me. I, uh... Make sure you shoot me in the head. No. I'll be with her and you'll be rotting in the streets. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... I'm glad too. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but... It's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. Oh, God damn it. Udaj. A gdzieś jak? To się tak nie On się na mnie rzuci, fuj. He would have come back. That's right, sweet pea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. You look horrible. I'm 
That's what he said. Let's just get somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Cleo, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. going to kill you and take you yeah Michał, to na tyle do zobaczenia trzymajcie się hej bye